What's up everybody and welcome back to the Court of the Cow YouTube channel. I am your host today, Curtis, and we got an episode we like to call Comic Crusades. Today we're going to play through some of the current comic book video games, and today we're going to be playing through episode one of the Batman Tall Tell series game. I have yet to play this. I've had it downloaded for a while, but I've been waiting to record it so I can play it for you guys. But let's just jump into it, man. Let's go. So turn it past 11, shout it to the heavens. The party started at our 25 in Evans. Turn it past 11, shout it to the heavens. The party started at our 25 in Evans. The Mountain West Sky rhythm like a go play in metronome. I'm sick and never hearing about my spot on the map. The frigid kids are spitting out performing professionals. And when I arrive, watch how the world react. Guys, here we go, jumping into episode one of the Batman Tall Tale game. Oh, excuse me. Dr. Pepper, man. Just killing me. Turn this up. Got a nice shot of Gotham. Where are we at? City Hall. I don't even know why people want to live in Gotham anymore. Just all, see? Always something happening to somebody. Like, you think people would be like, I'm just gonna move away. It's probably best for us and our family and whatnot. Get it open. On it. You think he's gonna show? We bring the whole goddamn place down. Stay focused. Of course he's gonna show. We'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. Ooh, you know he did. <laughs> Move in. How good is the casting for uh, J.K. Simmons for um, Commissioner Gordon? Like, just looking at this dude right here, and I'm just like, I'm going in. Perfect. Wait for backup. No need it. Take the stairs. I heard stories, you know. Sent three home in an ambulance. The rest in body bags. No wonder the cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. With all the other flying animals. Oh snap. It's about to go down. So the, if no one's ever played the Telltale games, they're basically point and click games where you kind of just press buttons. Go, it's basically to go through the story. But the cool thing about these games is that there's certain parts that can influence how the story is played out. I don't know how crazy it be dictated, but it's pretty interesting because you can almost make your own story. That man looks official. Come on, cuz. Bruce, you can't keep doing this. I have to. <laughs> no one else will. Every drop of blood, everything you've sacrificed, the city is safer now. But it's made you a target. And people will keep you in the crosshairs until you're shut out they of the They need sky. something to fear. Criminals in this city. They need something to fear. Just gonna leave that handprint for Alfred to clean up. Shit! You need to take responsibility, Bruce. The hell he gone? Whatever got in, don't let it get out. How terrifying would it be to be in one of their shoes and just seeing a shadow run around and then each one of your friends get picked off one by one. Like I'd be like, yo, I'm out. I quit. I'm going, I'm turning myself in or I'm reforming myself or doing whatever. 
Uh, what do I gotta do here? R2. Boom. Like, that's what nightmares are made up of, man. <laughs> He's taking people out. Now, I'm never really good at some of the moments where it's like you got a fast act of pressing the button, so I'll probably end up messing up a couple times. Who knows what will happen. We're just putting in work right now. Did you hear that Wilhelm scream? Yo, I'm out. Like, seriously, I am out. I am gone. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. A monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Come on. Let the Come monster on. out. Come on. Uh -oh. See, I almost messed up there. Yeah. Uh. Music kind of dope, right? Though, right? Missed one of them. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Oh, what's up, Selena? Behind you, big boy. Looking good in that cat suit. Payday. Dude, I just pressed a button on a whim. Did not mean to do that. Don't you know who I am? If you want to be intimidating, you're succeeding. Criminals are becoming afraid of you, so are the police. It's a scare tactic, Al. Just a performance. Are we about to fight right now? Not a scratch. So far. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why you do all this. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up. The city time. needs protecting. Gotham needs a hero. Someone to hunt down people like you. So that makes me what? A villain? She's gonna remember Sounds that. Fun. So that's the thing I also I like when you're the, the stuff that you chase. select dictates the game. It also influences the relationship you Do have not. with certain other characters. Don't you know not to corner so, a wild animal? That might it's come back dangerous. to bite me in the ass later on, but Let's put you in a cage. Hey, whatever. Bring man. that. Come on, girl. Come on. 
Stop trying to hit me! Hit me! Ah, oh, weak. Come on, bat. Come on, Selena! with this game like you'll be looking at stuff trying to like just pay attention to the story and then you're like something pops up and that you gotta do like the I played the Walking Dead Telltale game it was dope but I always was screwing stuff up because I wasn't paying attention it's over I wouldn't be so sure uh... Oh, I missed. Wait, did I get her? Oh. Poor then. Jesus. Got it. Wait, wait, wait. Do not shoot. Dude, I'm putting in work right now. <laughs> Dude, I want to see him just uppercut her. That's mean for me to say, but why go to all that trouble for this? Sounds like all of her queen. A myth can't be killed. You, however, are flesh and blood. No! God damn it! I said don't shoot! What was that? No. These trigger happy cops. <laughs> I'm out here trying to help, and they're putting bullets in me. Why can't it move? Why wouldn't it move? Yo, it's hard out, hard out in these streets being a superhero. <laughs> uh, and I wrong about you at that exact me. moment is when I would defecate everywhere. Not sure if it was for my sake or yours. Don't struggle, you'll fall. Don't struggle or you'll fall. Oh, but that's what you crave, the struggle. I know men like you. Okay. I was just trying to help. Step out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne tonight. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Well then. Alfred's always so awesome. Down to see like, the city. He's such a dope character. The one thing I read about this game is that you do a lot of stuff as Bruce Wayne as well, so that's cool. So I guess, I don't know what the next part is, but... Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. 
A humble district uh, it's attorney like, a, like myself uh, is not used to such a ringing endorsement. Fundraiser. Even for one who cut Gotham's crime rate. Harvey Dent. Pre. Two Face Harvey Dent. This city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, Dude, Harvey Dent looks like the diesel in that suit. Save our great city. Bodied up, man. If only Mr. Wayne, my campaign's largest backer, could have heard that applause, he would sh Well, there he is. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. Welcome, Welcome to, to Wayne, Wayne Manor, Manor, everyone. My apologies for the late arrival. Oh, not to worry, Mr. Wayne. We've all made ourselves very comfortable. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Together, we will change God. <laughs> Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know Dude, look how big Harvey is. Gotham, Why'd they make him so big? Lost on your way here. <laughs> Where were you? I know you prefer the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Sir, I'd like to make an entrance. Just wanted to make an entrance. Congratulations, you almost missed it. You are a pillar of this city and my campaign. I need you here, tuxedoed and shaking hands. No one came here tonight to see me. To see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> and I can see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. <laughs> Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. Doing this for Gotham. Do anything for Gotham. It's my home. It's our home. This will help you too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. But now all I need is a decent slogan. I'm terrible at those. It always makes me sound like a used car salesman. All right, all right. Our hope about, uh, is in Harvey. Our hope is in Harvey. Look at you. It's not half bad. I'm going to use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we changed Gotham. A city free from crime. Where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey. But you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands. Hmm? Come on. The pre two face Harvey was a stand up guy, man. Wrong place, wrong time, I guess. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. Dent from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your Look at those flowers. <laughs> you believe in Dent? <laughs> They're like, fuck it, let's just put some fake ass flowers all, in this game. Whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust someone like you to lead this city to greatness. Tonight is about Harvey. <laughs> well, I'm flattered, truly, but this night is about getting Harvey Dent elected so he can fix those potholes. Hmm. I think I speak for half the room when I say politicians are puppets. Oh, come on now, Bob. I'm not a politician. I'm a crusader. Hmm? No strings attached. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. You're preaching, dear. No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbox are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Oh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Look at Gotham now. Murder in the streets. The dude has no upper lip. City Hall, that cape bat freak. Kind of creepy. Vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn west. They can't even oh, go over Bobby. his... No, there it goes. Golden age, barely even goes over his you're top teeth. cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt. But don't even look one man <laughs> can't save this city. And it's a dangerous man. You know he goes to ten to so. a day. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Hope can light well, the I darkness. I have to say I side with your wife on this, Mr. Zellerbach. Even a spark of hope can light the darkness. Oh, 
An idealist with a bank account. They will He'll be that. broke before election day. Believe I that. Bruce would gladly spend every penny he has to fix this city. I don't doubt that for a moment. And don't worry, though. I am not doing this alone. With Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum with a state-of-the-art mental health facility to help Gotham's most at-risk individuals. It will be dedicated this to smug old guy is kind of getting on my nerves. In the hopes that their face with sunken eyes, will never no, be missing the upper lip. After all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible. Truly terrible. Uh, and tragedy like that at such a young age must have been crippling. If only that deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe. Uh, well, I don't. We're like here for Harvey, not me. And I'm sure you don't either. That's how you curve well, the question, Bruce. Harvey is the one who's been behind the project since day one. A vote for him is a vote for the memory of my parents. You'll have it. Thank you. Well, thank you both. And that's how it's done. Blah. <laughs> not saying I doubted you, but. That went better than expected. It is a night of ringing endorsements. Oh, well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor. I'm eager to know you. Vicki Vale, mm. not interested. And reporter Vicky vale. for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Actually, I'm here for Mr. Wayne. Well, he certainly doesn't have any Keep time. Keep it on. off the record. Tonight is strictly off the record. We can talk, but nothing gets written down. I'm okay with that. I was just hoping to see what makes Bruce Wayne tick. This is quite the social event, Mr. Oh, Wayne. Come on now, so formal. Call me Bruce. Okay, oh, Bruce. Bruce. He's like uh, going around uh, teasing everyone tonight. But how are you doing? You should enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Well, I'm doing better. Ooh, better doing. now that you're here. I'll tell you, if all these stuffed shirts weren't around, I'd give you the private tour. Mr. Wayne, you've got something on your collar. Um, is that blood? Yeah, it looks like. Oh, this. Cut myself uh, shaving. Just uh, cut myself shaving. What? Your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding, kidding. Do excuse me, Master Bruce. But, uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to this. greet this one personally, sir. Carmine Falcone. Oh. Uh, is the Dent campaign soliciting this votes dude. from Gotham's biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. Bruce is like, damn it, Harvey. <laughs> and what kind of business do you I'm putting the Mac like? down? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. It's in the service of a better Gotham for all of us. At least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. Jesus, Harvey, inviting a known criminal to your fundraiser? So I've been trying to be nice to everybody. Cringe. You know, be cool, be cordial, don't worry about that. be respectful. A word of warning. But I'm about to get super disrespectful to Carmine Falcone. Play. It's about to get all disrespectful up in here. You know, I've been in the market for a new house. Decent walk up, sky high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. I don't want to punch him in his chest. I ain't this stupid ass pacemaker Though the if he has. Core offends my eyes. I never Man, said it. All flash, no class. What? My family built this house. It's not for sale. Everything's for sale, Mr. Wayne. And everyone. Just need to find the right currency. Come on, throw come. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. Everyone's watching. You're a respectable man, I hear. Refuse.
Gentlemen, perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlour. Follow me, if you will.